The Academy students will gain an opportunity of a lifetime. The curriculum that they will engage in will be second to none because it's going to be at a rigor that they have never experienced before, most likely. On top of that, they'll be a part of a cadre of some of the sharpest students in the state where they will get a chance to help each other grow emotionally and socially and in all other dynamics. So often students who are gifted in math and science, those uncommon students who possess a zeal for learning, they, they often feel isolated from their peers because of that enthusiasm. Kentucky becomes one of a select number of states across the country to have a residential program like the Academy. This is the Academy for Math and Science, and it must represent with the diversity that we currently have within our state, and this will provide opportunities for all students to get to the next level. We must raise the bar in Kentucky. The identity of the Academy will truly reflect Kentucky, both in terms of geography, students from Paducah to Prestonsburg, as well as in terms of race and ethnicity. We want the Academy to truly look like Kentucky in every possible way. The Academy students will be selected through a four-step process. They will apply with an ACT or an SAT score. They will also provide their transcript from seventh grade through 10th grade. And the application process itself has several essay questions and recommendations that they'll need to get from people they work with over their high school career. On top of that, at the end of the process is an interview that we look for their maturity and their ability to engage at the college level. There are two goals for the Academy of Mathematics and Science in Kentucky. The first goal is to provide appropriately challenging learning opportunities for young people who are talented in science and math and who want to engage in careers in science, technology, engineering, and mathematics. The second goal is economic development for Kentucky. Because the Academy seeks to create a rich living and learning environment, all 120 students will live together in Schneider Hall. As one of the oldest and most historic buildings on campus, Schneider Hall is receiving a complete facelift so that students will live and learn in a state-of-the-art facility that combines community and personal space to create the overall Academy community. Opportunities to conduct research will definitely add to the education of Academy students. High school students don't always have research opportunities. These young people will be in laboratories throughout the campus as well as having opportunities for summer internships that involve research. The Academy seeks to create recreational opportunities and extracurricular opportunities that draw upon the individual interest of students. Uh, we're talking about 120 students who all have ideas about what they want to do. And while we'll have traditional activities, we also want to create opportunities across the board that provide for leadership, recreation, friendships, as well as responsibility. The 175 school districts in Kentucky will benefit greatly from having representation of students coming to Western Kentucky University, taking advantage of this two-year program with students leaving with two years of college or 60 hours. Economic development for Kentucky involves an entrepreneurial spirit. Young people who have the ability to create jobs as well as to fill them. Kentucky will benefit in many ways, but in particular, we believe it will eliminate the brain drain for our students who are going off to other states to create their careers there. As they experience a wonderful opportunity here, I think they will want to bring back their gifts and strengths and create jobs in their home communities all across the state. Success for the Academy will be measured in the future by what these young people are doing. Hopefully they'll be living their adult lives in Kentucky and they will be contributing to the economy.